Hi everyone, it's Cheyenne. So I know this is a little bit late and that's because I just woke up. Um, I wasn't feeling too hot originally, but I'm a little bit better right now. But my throat is like full of gunk. I've been trying to sing, but it is not working. Uh, my voice keeps breaking because of all the crap that's in my throat. Uh, I just wish this would go away already, you know? It's terrible. But, um, there's something I was going to say, and I just, I can't keep a hold on my train of thought lately, so, yeah. I don't know, I kind of, I miss talking like I used to, like, uh, I went back, and every time I go to read a comment on my silent screen video, I, uh, listen to the song again because I don't ever pause it before I go down. Like, sometimes I do, but I don't always. And I was listening to some of the stuff that I said at the end of, video, uh, end of the video, and I was thinking about my old, um, Just Had to Speak Up video and my old acceptance videos and stuff. And <clears throat> I just, I kind of miss talking like that to you guys because I don't want you guys to forget that you guys, you know, you have your own place in this world and that you guys can do really anything that you want to and I feel as though I don't really quite say it enough so I wanted to sit down and just say that you guys you really do rock you sh you guys rock and you know just because I say that so much I said this in my last video I think just because I say all this stuff so much it doesn't mean that I mean it any less, it doesn't mean it means any less, it doesn't make it any less true, it just means that I really do want you guys to remember how much you guys matter, and how much you guys just, you know, maybe you don't realize it, maybe you do realize it, maybe you're getting annoyed for me saying this so much, but you guys are amazing, and you guys should do whatever you put your minds to. Except for no, maybe killing people. That that's not that's not a good idea. Let's not do that one. Okay. So uh, let's put that on the back burner. It's way 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 all the way back. Okay. Good. All right. Um, I don't want to see you guys in jail. That'd be bad. That'd be very bad. But I mean, ugh, you know, I just I feel so like it kind of makes me a little bit sad when I see people putting themselves down and said, and I know I do it to myself quite often, and th I mean, I think that's a pretty human thing to do. Uh, we're always worried that if we, we build ourselves up, that either A, we'll fall, or <clears throat> B, we will get berated and just torn down instead, uh, or C, both, and I mean, there might be people in this world who will try to tear you down no matter what. Even when you're already at your lowest point, they will try to keep you there. I mean, quoting Rocky Balboa, yes, I did watch those movies because they're good movies and my dad loves them as well. So, anyways, <clears throat> quoting Rocky Balboa, life will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how much you can take. Or how many hits you can take. And still keep going. And such like that. I shortened it and screwed up. But essentially that's what he's saying. It's, you know, people are going to try to beat you down as much as they can. And life is going to try to beat you down as much as it can. Because life is life. It picks no favorites, as though, even though it seems it like it does, it picks no favorites. It, you know, likes and hates all of us equally, and we all go through a lot of crap in our lives. And it's going to get hard, and you, there are going to be times that you want to give up. There are going to be times that you just want to shut the world away. But, I mean, you can't stay down. You know?
something else that I always say is this thing that I've that I wrote down once last year, whatever. However, I'm going to continue on it, which I've only ever continued on it once or twice, I think. Beauty, no, no, shoot, I already screwed up. Perfection lies within imperfection. Beauty lies within the mistakes that we make and how many times we pick ourselves up when we fall down. And, you know, something else I've said uh, with pertaining to life and pertaining to be being a type of hero because I mean I've seen plenty of people called heroes I've seen um, Jack Septicai was called a hero Mark Pye was called a hero of course you guys might already know that um, most any kids who love their parents will think that they're some kind of heroes at one point in their lives uh, and I mean every day let me put this this way I every day I have met many heroes, not just on screen, not just in my family, but every day. And here's why. Because what makes us a hero isn't how strong we are physically. It isn't how many abilities we have. What makes you a hero is what you do with what life throws at you. Because yes, you could give up. You could throw it all away to the side and say, I'm done. However, every time you stand back up, every time you push back and you push through everything that you're going through, you're a hero. I don't get, I don't care what anyone else says. You are a hero. Every time you help someone, Every time you give a piece of your heart just to help someone stand, someone else stand back up, you have become a hero. To quote a song by Super Chick, heroes do what's right. Heroes make a choice. And depending on that choice, that decides your life. No one else can have control over you. No one else can have control over your life. That is all up to you and all up to the decisions you make. Now, yes, someone can have an influence on how you control your life if you always listen to them. However, that's you making the decision to listen to someone else. I wouldn't suggest it. Trust me, by the end of it, you'll regret it. I mean... 90% of the time, we always wonder what would have happened if we had done the other thing. But I've found that a lot of people are a lot happier when they do what they want to do. And not what the people in their lives want them to do. Because if those people who, you know, say that they want the best for you and say that they want this and want that for you, if they really matter, they will love you no matter what path you take. I really hope that you're not taking the path to like, you know, ruining your health or anything like that because, I mean, you guys are pretty awesome, like, just, you know, bad drugs and stuff and all that, let's push that away. I know, you don't have to listen to me. But it's not good for you, and I'd rather you guys be healthy. But let's say you wanted to write books for the rest of your life. That's what you wanted. It, what, it's what makes you happy. You love writing stories. You love doing this. Or maybe you want to take pictures, or you want to be a businessman, or you don't want to be a businessman, or you want to be a football player, or heck, you want to be a cheerleader for the rest of your life. If the people in your life really matter, if they really are true to you, they'll just be happy that you're happy. You know, like I've always said, don't change unless it's what you want. It doesn't matter 
I mean, really, you're going to do what you want, truly, because... But there are people who don't do what they want. They do what others want because they want to make them happy. And it's kind of like a sandwich. On the bottom is what you want, what they want, and then you wanting to make them happy seems to be what you have on top there. You need to flip it. Anyways, if any of these ramblings have made sense, I hope you liked it. And I really mean it, you guys. You guys are amazing. And don't forget it. And don't forget to dance today. I am working on that dance. I'm getting better. Um, I'm starting to get more of the moves down in order and everything with it. But it it is, like, I'm noticing more and more that's wrong with what I'm doing. And trust me, I want to make this look good. So I'm getting there, but I'm not there yet. And so uh, just keep your fingers crossed that I'll get it down soon. Alrighty. Um, I love you guys so much. Stay you. Believe in yourselves because you guys are amazing and you matter. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later.